Hi, welcome to Drive With Care. I have had a request. <laughs> Don't seem to get many requests lately. Apart from one that's saying I should take my own my life in my own hands and go to Calais. <laughs> Which I think I'd like to do, but work is kind of, you know, so busy you can't do it. Unless I book a weekend. Anyway, Anna Dayton, 4835, says, Hello, would you drive from Faversham to Whitstable on B Roads? Have to go there at some point. Thank you. So it's not a route I'm familiar with. So we're all, you know, got to go there at some point. Because normally, if I'm going to Whitstable, I'll just jump on the um, on the fast road, won't I? So B roads. We're going to start here in Faversham, obviously Faversham to Whitstable. Let's do it. Let's see if we can get lost. <laughs> this is for you, Anna. Right, starting at the kind of the key side, Parish and Brewery, Shepherd Neem, etc. Get up into the town, turn left after Tesco, past the recreation ground, and then out onto the B roads. Watch out for some hazards. All routes A2, M2. It is a Sunday, so we've got all the Sunday market up ahead there. Zebra crossing, man waiting, two men waiting. They're going to buy their bric-a-brac. Some plays football there, and his team play opposite Faversham. Got a new pedestrian crossing ahead, pumps in the road for 400 yards. Wonder if that's what inspired um, McCartney to write that song. <laughs> Gotta skip over the hump. Because hump in the road has kind of sexual connotations, doesn't it? And McCartney wrote, Why don't we do it in the road? Why don't we do it in the road? A song of very little lyrics. Roundabout head and bend in the road. Appropriately named Whitstable Road. So we go along here to Graveney, and then there's a left hand turn which will take us on the B roads all the way to Whitstable. I just have to make sure I turn off on the correct road. <laughs> to the 30 and into the national speed limit.
because I want a left-hand turn, I'm going to look for the sign that tells me there's a left-hand turn up ahead. Hopefully there will be one. Godness Stone and Gravney, that's what I want. And there's a car coming out of that exact junction. So that road, to turn left here, should take me all the way to Whitstable on the B roads. Mile an hour zone. Kind of narrow, so I'm going to keep my eyes peeled for passing places. I think you can get two cars through here easily. but it is a 30 zone. Right, cars parked all along the right. Got to watch for oncoming traffic. Give me a bit of a flash. I'll see the coast in a minute.
the alert the wall defences, the sea defences, so coast right on the left there. Got a bunch of cyclists not adhering to the single file, which I think is fine apparently. You can have cyclists doing two abreast, but when they start taking over the road, classic beetle, nice, and a runner, it's all happening at Whitstable. I can't see beyond the first cyclist and there's a good reason why the car comes zooming along. I will overtake when it's clear. That is not clear. Sea Salter Sailing Club. Yes, you have a car behind you, that's right. I'm going to go for it. At least for the first two. And the second two. I'm looking for the reminder speed, you know, speed restrictions, speed signs. I'm guessing 30, could be 40. It must be 40 because we're about to enter a 30. Didn't see any of those repeaters then. Quick look in my rearview mirror. Oh, it was national speed limit back there. To a thirty now. Definitely has a feel of sea shanty, doesn't it? Little sea huts or beach huts. in the car. Red van overtaking cyclist. Seems a longer route, doesn't it, from Faversham? Coming down these um, country lanes or B, B roads. Less hectic than the actual A2, though, or whatever the 259 is it? 256? Never remember. Priority over oncoming vehicles, but there are none. One has to ask oneself, when will one get into Whitstable? Right, cars parked on the left end, it's a bend, keeping my eyes peeled for oncoming traffic. Nothing coming. actually know where this comes out in, in Whitstable, so your guess is as good as mine.
kind of got it in my head that the picture I've got is Herne Bay, that I'm coming into Herne Bay and not Whitstable, so yeah, it's really confusing. Car waiting to come out, we've got cars parked on my side of the road. When will I get there? This is <laughs> confusing me. It looks like we've got a junction up ahead. Got pedestrian crossing. Oh, is this where the petrol station is? Yes, the jet carriage. So this now goes down into Whitstable. I know where I am now. <laughs> Took me a while to work it out. So apologies if you just like watching 10 minutes, you know, 10 minute videos, but it was a request and I'm happy, I'm happy to do requests. Motorcyclist being let out. Man sitting on wall watching the world go by. <laughs> Smoking his pipe. Shall I go straight across down the high street? It'll give us a, a, a kind of a feel for um, hazards and perception, won't it? Car turning. Cyclists walking across the zip road. Road ahead closed, so I've got to turn left. Interesting. I think I might just pull up on the left after the taxi's pulled up on the left. I don't know where it's closed. Diverted traffic. head closed doesn't seem to mean anything. I'm still going all the way. Interesting. I don't know where the road was closed, people. It was closed up ahead. I'm going to pull up here in the taxi rank quickly just to end the video. There you go, and the date, and that was Faversham to Whitstable via the B Road. I don't know if there are any others, but that one works, so 20 minute video? Crikey. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now. Drive with care.